And hello, wherever you're watching, welcome to North London. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you commentary, and joining me is the former Arsenal defender, Lee Dixon. And we have action to bring you from the round of 16 in the Carabao Cup. It is Tottenham Hotspur up against Leeds United. Well, thank you, Derek. Well, you look at the hosts being such big favourites in this game. Just wonder how their opponents approach the game. I think the key to this is keep it really tight in the first 20 minutes. Try and frustrate those home fans. And then hopefully you can nick a goal here and there and take your opportunities. This is the starting lineup for Tottenham Hotspur. One fight starts with Jan Vertonghen at the back. Harry Winks plays with Giovanni Lo Celso in central midfield. And in attack, the always dangerous Harry Kane. And a look at the Leeds United starting 11. An element of caution about this selection. Yeah, 4 5 1, Derek. The five players behind the lone striker will need to support him. Looks very strong midfield offensively and also defensively. The back four will be protected throughout the game. Thank you. Enjoy the game. And the match begins. Ryan Sessegnon has it. Winks. Lamela with it. Lamela. Lost possession. Not giving him a moment's peace. Mateusz Klich. Klich. Jack Harrison has it. Klich. An important interception. And in with a real chance. Will he? An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, it's a lovely goal. The pass was sublime, but then the finish. Not easy sometimes when you have so much time to think about it. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, the manager knows the importance of that goal. He also knows that you're at your most vulnerable just after you've scored. Underway again, and Tottenham Tottenham with the advantage. Number 10, Harry Kane. Berardi. Harrison. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Alioski has it. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Firing it towards goal. Here's Lo Celso. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Lamela, and attempting the through ball. Off the post, and back in play. And no-nonsense defensive clearance. Winks. Well, sometimes you can't argue with top-notch defending. Well, they're still in it. Just. That goes in, it's all over. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. It's with fight. For Tongan.
and Tottenham make progress but what can they produce from this position? Ailing, Adam Forshaw with it. An unforced error, you've got to say. Ruyeg, Vertonghen with it. He needs to get rid of that fast. And news of a goal in the Nottingham Forest match, Alan McAnally. Well, visionary passing. He's just got to continue his run. He's got to score! Goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. I cannot believe he's kept that out the net. Absolutely amazing. Corner kick played in. Apologies to Alan McAnally for having to cut him off. To clarify, Nottingham Forest have scored in that game. And they now hold a 1-0 lead. It's with Bergwijn. They've regained possession. It's with Gasaniga. And the keeper's given it away inexcusably. Real danger. Harrison. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. The outcome is a goal kick here. And we very much hope you'll join us for more live Premier League action on EA TV. It's Tottenham Hotspur facing Everton. Yeah, it's very easy to build a case for those two teams to make that game a real cracker. You should be tuning in for that one. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? And he's made headway. Big chance it is. Possession changes hands. The interception there. Throw in here for Spurs. Here's Lo Celso. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Well, an effort he would like to airbrush from history. Well, he should be doing better than that. He had options around him too. He chose the wrong one. Yeah, yeah. Gaetano Berardi. Klich. Harrison. Adam Forshaw with it. At times they make passing look easy. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Tremendous ball played through. Lamela. Kane. Well, it was a fine counter-attack, but no end product, Lee. Yeah, lacked a little composure at the end, Derek, but they're so lethal on the break with the pace they have. Well, the manager can't hide his disappointment at not extending the lead there. It's still on a knife edge. Sessegnon Henry Vertonghen Harry Winks now 
And they did have the ball, but not anymore. Not a fantastic piece of defending, was it? It's there for him! And the keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. And they'll have to throw it back in play. On the ball, Luke Ayling. Adam Forshaw with it. Cleek. A tremendous vision. Tremendous intuition to win it back. And Bamford. It's all about translating threats into goals. That's a very impressive piece of defending. Chance to attack using wit. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. That is excellent pressure high up the pitch. He might be able to profit from the wide position. A chance to whip it in. Shot attempted. Well, body in the way. <laughs> so the corner played into the box, and it all counts for naught. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Sessegnon. A chance, maybe, from the wide position. A good and fair challenge. to be a throw-in. Crossing opportunity. Not far away at all with the volley. Well, to catch it like that, you've got to have really good technique. And oh, so close. Vertonghen. It's a weighted pass. Lamela, and he's broken free. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. Time for us to get an update on the Forest game. I hear there's been a goal on that match, Alan McAdally. It's a second goal for Nottingham Forest. It's been scored by Sami Amiobi. The fullback failed to deal with the cross from the left, and he took full advantage to pounce and prod the ball home. 41 minutes played, 2 0. Alan McAdally keeping us right up to date. Lamela. Fruitful looking attack. He's in with a chance. Must score. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Going short. And that was a very fine read. Cleek. Just not looking confident in possession. Can't miss, surely! 
playing. I don't think the goalkeeper will be complaining about poor finishing like that, Lee. No, it's not about the goalkeeper, it's about that poor effort. That really is awful. Oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. He's got space. Sessegnon. He's gone for power, Lee, but it's wide. Well, no real direction, but the power was there. And you're right, it's just gone past the post. Well, he's been kicking and heading every ball in that technical area. They've been good up to now, but it's still fine margins. Well, that is that. The first half is over here in London tonight. And the match begins... And in with a real chance. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Lamela. Kane. Well, that was a fine counter-attack, but no end product, Lee. Yeah, lacked a little composure at the end, Derek, but they're so lethal on the break. Shot attempted. Well, body in the way. Well, to catch it like that, you've got to have really good technique. And also... Must score! And that, a piece of goalkeeping, you're going to see again and again and again. Sessegnon. He's gone for power, Lee, but it's wide. Well, no real direction, but the power was there. And you're right, it's just gone past the post. So here we go, into the second half at the home of Tottenham Hotspur. Splendid tackle and a throw-in coming up. I must say, no shortage of space. Pablo Hernandez. Hernandez. Went in strongly, decisively. Throw-ins given. On the ball, Luke Ayling. He has time to play it over. Looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game. And news of a goal in the Nottingham Forest match. Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Nottingham Forest. 50 minutes, please. 3-0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. Could it keep the ball? Cleach. Harrison, Cleach. Ball's gone. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Can he take the chance? Well, body in the way. Great pressure to win the ball back. And thumped away.
Roselso. Steven Bergwijn. Crossing opportunity. Cutting in. What can he? It's got to be. Goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. I cannot believe he's kept that out the net. Absolutely amazing. Well, if you look at those stats on the creativity of the team, the game should be over, but it's not. Their forwards have got to do more. Well, getting right in their opponent's faces, forcing that hurried clearance, and a throw it'll be. Fight has it. Here's Lo Celso. Rueg. Oh, that's an interesting pass. A deft clearance. A good and fair challenge. Mateusz Klich. And now it's Phillips. Giving them the gift of possession. Winks. Won it back. Firing it towards goal. Tottenham couldn't maintain possession. Half an hour remaining then. The switch of play now. A highly purposeful attack, this. The emphasis on getting the ball forward. Steven Bergwijn. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Alioski has it. Harrison. And the ball's gone. Winks. Roselso. Lamela with it. Being pressed and pressed high. Sessegnon. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. For Tongan. Winks. Kane. And very deftly cut out. Might really be able to trouble them here. A real opening now. Keeper did his job to begin with. Sessegnon, and he's beaten him here. Lo Celso. Alioski has it. Just can't seem to get out of their own half, and that's down to the pressure. Here's Lo Celso. Rueg. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. He's enjoying space. Time for us to get an update on the Forest game. I hear there's been a goal on that match, Alan McAvally. It's another goal from Nottingham Forest. It's been scored by Sami Amiobi. He showed great composure to take his time when put clear and find the bottom corner. 72 minutes played, 4-0. Thanks as ever for the update, Alan. Throw in here for Spurs. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Harry Winks now.
Lamela with it. Lo Celso. Real chance. And the goal gaping at him. And a big moment, a goal for Tottenham Hotspur. And they are going to be difficult to stop now. Well, it's good play. Ian Wright always told me, stand in the middle of the goal. It sounds simple, but you don't have to get a lot of goals from that position. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Well, a second goal for them here. Goal for Tottenham Hotspur, number 10, Harry Kane. Harrison. Substitution for Tottenham Hotspur. Dallas here. Coming off the pitch, number 11, Eric Lamella. Coming onto the pitch, number 20. Cleef. Well, yeah, oh, they've lost possession of the ball. For Tongan. Wait. Kane. Deli Alley. Deli Alley. Well, it's goal after goal after goal. Just no end to this. A brilliant display. Well, here we see a better angle on it. There's nothing the keeper can do. A significant deflection, and he's beaten. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Well, there's nothing better for a manager when a plan comes together. Total satisfaction. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. So they restart the game, and only Tottenham one team in it. Goal. Number 20, Deli Alley. Harrison. Well, he's going to be disappointed with that pass. It's a weighted pass, and well, it all counts for naught. For Tongan. Elder Costa. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. Crossing opportunity. Not all that convincing defensively. Here's Ndombele. Giving the ball away. And a Tottenham Hotspur free kick coming up. Foyt has it. Deli Alley now. Opportunity to deliver the cross. It did take a touch on the way through, hence a corner. A really terrific outing from Harry Kane so far, truly making his presence felt, Lee. Yeah, he's been the key player today in terms of how much ball he's had. He's really hurting this defence. They can't cope with him. Goals everywhere. And they've gone for the short corner. Deli Alley. And it's Winks. Crossing possibilities. Here's Lo Celso. Phillips. Fine teamwork to win it back. Elder Costa. Good technique displayed. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming.
please give a round of applause for today's man of the match, number 10, Harry Kane. Dujek. Real danger. And teammates to play it to. And there's the feed into the box. Cleared away comprehensively. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Spurs trying to use space to good effect. Possession changes hands. The interception there. Harry Winks now. And Scott for the cross. A really top-notch piece of defending. Ailing. And that is all. The final whistle has sounded. And that makes it official. They're through to the next round. Well, you do have to say, Derek, that he's stern a test to follow, but I really like watching this team. They've progressed to the next round, fully deserved. What awaits them in the next round, we wait and see, but I'm excited about their future. And in with a real chance. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Lamela. Kane. Well, it was a fine counter-attack, but no end product, Lee. Yeah, lacked a little composure at the end, Derek, but they're so lethal on the break. Shot attempted. Well, body in the way. Well, to catch it like that, you've got to have really good technique and also... Must score! And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Sessegnon. He's gone for power, Lee, but it's wide. Well, no real direction, but the power was there. And you're right, it's just gone past the post. And a big moment, a call for Tottenham Hotspur. And they are going to be difficult to stop now. Kane. Deli Alley. Deli Alley. Well, it's goal after goal after goal. Just no end to this. A brilliant display.
Just got a couple of questions for you regarding the match. No further questions, thanks so much.